Hi, and welcome to another video by The Peppy Techie. Today we are going to do Photoscape 10 or X. It is my first video on Photoscape 10. I've actually been playing with the program and I like it a lot. My problem is you have Photoscape 10, you can download it from the Windows Store, and Photoscape 10 Pro. The Pros cost $39.99. Let's cut to the chase, it's 40 bucks. So I'm not gonna pay the 40 bucks right now. Maybe in the future I will. All my tutorials are going to be on the free Photoscape 10. Right now, let's take a look at whitening teeth. If you saw my video in 3.7, now we're gonna do the same video in Photoscape 10. So let's take a look. This is your, um, when you start out, you have um, a different interface than we used to. But right here, you have the viewer and the editor, cutout, batch, collage, combine, GIF, print, and tools, very similar. We're gonna go right to the editor, and we're gonna get a different set of teeth than I did in the other video. And we are just gonna make it really simple. We're going to come up to tools and paint. Uh, you can choose your brush side. I'm gonna do this size right here. Now, I, I'm going to tell you that what I like of this program is uh, there's a lot of things. First of all, I have a minus brush as well as a plus. So if I do too much, I can take it away. Something I didn't have in 3.7. I can show a mask when I'm drawing, which is very cool. We'll do that in a second. I can also choose the hardness and the softness of my brush. Here's where I choose the color. And again, FFFFF is pure white. And I can choose opacity which is great when I'm doing something like this because I'm gonna set it about 42 and let's color these this teeth here. So we're gonna start about 42. And I also notice that I can go over a color and it doesn't double paint. So I can do this over and over and over and it just doesn't double paint it. It's amazing. Uh, so I always do one tooth at a time. Uh, that's just uh, sort of a, a habit. Maybe I can break it with this program, but I don't like to undo uh, something. And when you get over here and you're real close to gums, you might want to reduce your... Um, but that's all you do. You're just going to paint over it. Uh, I'm not going to go over every tooth today, um, but you just paint over it. This is easy and really nice. I, I really like this program. I'm going to reduce my brush size right here. Um, just really simple. Uh, again, this, these teeth aren't as bad as my other ones that I did in my last video. That looks amazing. And I can apply this. Uh, I'm going to show you the mask. So it shows you what you painted. So the cool thing is, now I know, ooh, I missed some a little bit. So I can come back with the mask. And especially when you're doing teeth, it's really helpful. So I'm going to go back to show mask. And you have to keep the mouse down when you do that. So otherwise you lose it. So I'm going to come down in here. It's really helpful when you have the mask. So I just painted the mask. Wow, that looks really good. And if I think maybe it's too much, I can bring the opacity all the way down and just slowly bring it up because you don't want the teeth to look you know someone if it's your these are not my teeth uh, but if they are your teeth people are like hmm she really whitened her teeth so i'm going to apply this and notice i have the opacity about 30 and that's pretty nice another thing about photoscape 10 that i really like i can just compare to the original and uh, see what i've done and of course i can revert if i didn't save it so we're going to save this and i'll do a save as now I've saved those teeth. So that's it. That's how you whiten teeth using Photoscape 10. I can tell you it's one, it's faster than 3.7. You have a lot more options. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Hope you'll subscribe to the Peppy Techie channel. Please make sure you hit the bell so you'll be notified when I make a new video. And leave your comments down below. Your questions, your thoughts, even your advice is much appreciated. And don't forget to smash that like button. Thanks for watching the Peppy Techie channel.